guys, it's Kata Potato here and basically today I'm just sitting in my house doing Jack EC, doing nothing basically, that's New Zealand language for nothing. And basically I'm just sitting here waiting for my packages to come and um, guess what, they're not here. How long does it take to get the Jeffree Star summer collection to my house? I just want to know very politely and kindly, to be honest, please, because I have been waiting so long. It's been like two weeks. It's been like a week and a bit or something like that. It's been far too long. How long? There's flights from LA to Auckland every single day. It takes about 12 hours to get from New Zealand to LA. How come my packages isn't on an airplane right now being shipped to me right now, please? I've got eye poos in my eyes. Let me just take that out of my eyes. Any more? Yes. Okay, I've got none now. Basically, I just want to bloody know because I have been waiting so patiently. Like, I don't know why the post office is so racist against me. I don't know what I've done. I don't know what I've done to deserve this. I've been waiting patiently outside my window, waiting for my makeup to turn up, and it's not turning up. I can't believe this. How come that I can buy a dog toy from China and it can be here to, like the next day? I want to know how and why. I am literally the nicest person in the entire world. Why doesn't this kind of crap happen to my ex-boyfriend? I just don't get it. I just don't understand. I can't leave my house. I actually can't leave my house to go and get something to eat. There's nothing to eat here. There's dog food. I'm not a dog last time I checked. Lots of you might think that I am a dog, but I'm actually um, not. And basically, I can't leave this house to go and get something to eat because just in case I miss the postman who's got my makeup. Okay, it's so hard on me. You guys just don't get it. Okay, I paid for these and This is what I get in return. I get nothing I just don't understand New Zealand as a country, you know, it's a country with people in it like me who desperately want their makeup from LA I don't know why the postmen muck me around like this. It's honestly so rude and it's homophobic, sexist, and solicitation of an underage minor. Okay. I think it's fraud as well. I have got every right to ring up the post office and go, where the heck is my makeup? Where? Because I've been waiting here patiently waiting for it to come and it's not coming. So I've got, um, it's UPS. I don't know what that even means. United Parcel People. I don't know UPS. U United States People. No, Parcels. And then the S start is just the Parcels part, maybe. I don't know. But I have looked up to see where the heck are my stuff, okay? And the Jeffree Star one says it's in transaction in New Zealand. I go, okay, cool. If it's in New Zealand, why is it not here right now? Don't they know who they're dealing with right now? I am the eyebrow queen of the Southern Hemisphere, and they're mucking me around like this. They wouldn't do this to the queen, I reckon. I don't think they actually would. And that's what makes me so offended, because... I am a queen of the Summon Hemisphere, you know? It's interesting that they're mucking around someone like me because I could ruin their lives. <laughs> One eyebrow hair at a time. Also, can I just, I'm just going to insert a clip of where my, right now, where my um, Juvia's Palace or whatever it's called, Juvia's Palace palettes are right now, okay? Take a look at this. This is me just looking at my Juvia's, whatever it's called thing, okay? I'm here. This is my home, Auckland. Current shipment location. And I was thinking to myself, what the heck is it doing in Wellington? So I'm just going to zoom in a bit more. This is where um, my boyfriend is originally from. He's from Wellington, okay? Um, so then we go in a little bit closer. And I'm thinking, oh my god, it's on the Carpety Marine Reserve. What? And so I look a little bit closer. No, let's go closer. It's in the middle of the ocean. It's not even on the marine reef right here. It's not even on the Car Carpety Island. It's not even on this little tiny piddly ass thing. It's in the middle of the bloody water. 
So that's good, isn't it? So I've spent 123 USD, code Nikki for $8 off, on the Magic Palette, the Zulu pal Palette, and then some other palette, I can't remember what. But yeah, so I'm stuffed also on this package, so I'm never going to get this. I don't know why I even bloody bother, to be honest. Confirmed 12th of June. It's nearly been a month since I ordered two, no, not two, three eyeshadow, eyeshadow palettes, and now it's in the middle of the of the bloody water. It didn't even make it, didn't even make it to my destination, which is over here. I just don't know what I've done to deserve this. So thanks a lot. New Zealand postage people and other people around the world who just don't give a flying crap about New Zealand. I think it's quicker that I just catch a plane, go and get the parcel myself, and then come back. And I'll be here in like 24 hours. One day postage, and I actually post to myself to go and get my package. Also, another thing that I want to mention is that my postage that I chose to get it sent here is like first class international United States or whatever. Um, if I got this for first class on an actual real airplane, I would actually ask for a refund. Because honestly, I don't feel like I'm in first class here. I feel like I'm in the last class. I feel like I'm in the dumb class. I feel like that I am literally situated in the toilet area, the like port thing in the airplane. That's how I feel right now. I feel really personally attacked and I feel really, really, really really uncomfortable about this and I feel like I haven't paid for first class I think it's just a title that they just chuck around and then they just go yeah you're gonna get first class well guess what I didn't but yeah so I'm gonna go now and I'm just gonna sit here and just do like a deer and brown and just sit at the window and just hope to god is that them no it's just a odyssey with like eight kids in it why are they not at school I'll deal with them later. I'm gonna go now and just de and be depressed. So yeah, um, if you think that your life is bad, think about me for just a second. It's not all about you, it is about me. So um, yeah, stay groovy. Okay, false alarm, the doorbell just went and um, I've got my palettes, but I'm still pissed off because I literally ordered this on literal, like the 19th of May, 1987, and it's just turned up now. So I'm kind of still pissed off about it, but one of my packages have turned up. My Jeffree Star Summer Collection hasn't turned up yet. Okay. So I'm still a bit upset. But I've got these beautiful palettes. I've got this one. And this beautiful one here. Which they all look exactly the same. So that's really cool. Um, let me just watch one for you guys. Oh. Oh, look. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Let me just try a little bit of... Oh, yeah. It's pretty... It's pretty nice. That's pretty. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay, cool. Well, one of my packages have turned up, so that's cool. But um, I'm still waiting on the rest. Oh, they got a shade called Nana. I love my Nana. I'm gonna go now. Um, I'm still waiting for my Jeffree Star summer collection, and honestly, my patience is limited. So limited edition. Okay, so stay groovy. Bye.